The Seattle Mariners need to string some wins together to keep pace with the first place Texas Rangers who are red hot. As Keith Oso tells us, the Rangers are winning a lot of games right now and something to do with the fact that a few of them started right here in Spokane. The Texas Rangers are sitting on top of the American League West and they're looking down on the rest of the division with some familiar faces. A lot of these players were in Spokane only a few years ago. It doesn't seem like it was that long ago. Um, I think the experience in itself was just uh, kind of a, I don't want to say life altering, but it's one of those things that, you know, it was my first ch uh, taste of pro ball and um, to play in a stadium like that and, and to have those fans, I mean, you can't ask for a better place to start your career. I had a great time. It's a, it's a great city, a great uh, ballpark for, for young guys coming out of college, getting a taste of the pro experience. The former Indians are playing well at the major league level, and some of that success comes from playing alongside the guys you played with throughout the minors. It's always nice to kind of start off uh, at the same place and, and move up together. You know, you come up to the big leagues, you're familiar with some guys that you've played with before, and it makes it a little bit easier. I think it makes it a little bit easier just adjusting and um, having guys that, that you, uh, you've you played with all along the way. When these players were in Spokane, they were dreaming of one day playing in the majors. Now that they're there, they say it was everything they hoped it would be. Absolutely. Uh, everything is, is what you would least think it would be, and once it actually happens, it's just it's, it's crazy, you know, uh, all the things that uh, come your way, man. It's just, uh, it's, I'm blessed and you know, I'm grateful for this opportunity, and I'm just going to try to make the most of it. A lot of familiar faces on this team, and I guess we'll have to wait till this summer to see which Spokane Indians might be headed here to join this team. In Seattle, I'm Keith Oso, KXOY4 HD Sports.